hi guys so i'm back to do a video on my most used products um it's been a i don't think i ever did a video like this before but i just wanted to suggest like these are like drugstore products so my most used drugstore products nothing in here is from mac or anything but i really get just got like a lot of stuff so i can't really um, do a video on some of that stuff because I haven't been using it for a while, but there's been a lot of stuff I've been constantly buying when I run out of it. So, the first most used thing I use like every single day, where is my, um, I use this stuff every single day. And this is my e.l.f. Um, Mist and Setting Spray. Please excuse my nails. If you're a mommy, me washing dishes and Handle my son. My nails do not last long. They last about a day or two. And the nail polish is always chipping off. And I just leave them. So please excuse my nails. So as I told you guys. My first favorite product. Most used product is the e.l.f. setting spray. You can purchase from e.l.f. cosmetic online. At uh, Walmart or Target. I use this stuff every time. I, I tell you I don't wear makeup every day. But when I do. And I had this for about. I don't know if you can see how much in there. But there's about that much in there. And I had this for about at least four months now. So it lasts a long time. That's the good thing about makeup. Because most of the things you buy, it lasts a while. Some of the stuff. Not everything. But mostly all the stuff lasts a while. <sighs> the next thing you guys always see me use my video. And this is the Hard Candy Heat Wave. And it's a um, Natural Glow Bronzer. Bronzer. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But you're going to... Um, Hard candy, I think you can only purchase that at Walmart, but I dropped this and I couldn't put it back together, so that's why it looks like that, but this is my favorite bronzer, and I, I don't use it as a bronzer, but I use it as, since it has that, like, that glow to it, I use it as a highlight for my under eye, con after I put on my under eye concealer, so I basically use it for a highlight under my eyes, so I love this stuff, like, I... This is my favorite. I don't know how I live without this stuff because it gives me a natural glow under my eyes. I love this stuff so much. Okay, guys. So my next most used product is the Elf Mineralize Face Primer. Now, also person that purchases from Target. Um, the um the one I use up, which I should have put in this video, I used up a while back, is the Hard Candy face primer that's the first face primer i ever used before so i don't know why i didn't there's like a drop left in here this is a hard candy primer and base for all over your face um this have more like a lotion a lotion feel to it so it's like a thick and this is more like a creamy so i think and it gives me a glow because i have really good dry skin but these are the two primers that I mostly use. So yeah, this is a Hard Candy um, Primer and the Elf Mineralized Face Primer. So these two are really good drugstore um, primer. And I wanted to try the Baby Lips, is that what it's called? Primer, I saw everyone else raving about. So I think I'm going to give that a try. So yeah, these two are the only two primers I ever used before. And they worked pretty well for drugstore primers. Um... Next thing you guys all always see me use in my um my tutorials or whatever. This is my also my most used product is the LA Girl Pro concealer. And I think it's in Toffee. Right here. And I've been using this primer for a while, like months now. And it's a really good co coverage. It reminds me of the Matte Pro Long Concealer. But I really like my LA Girl concealer better. I know a lot of people would disagree with me on that. But I really like the... Because I don't think it really gets my black areas under my eyes. Like the LA Girl. I don't think... Yeah. So I really love my... The LA Girl um, concealer. It's a really good concealer for the price. Only $2. No more than $2. And my most used... Oops, my most used mascara you guys always see me use the rocket. I think this was my very first mascara. 
no my second mascara I ever bought before but I love to use this after I use a really small wand I can't open it so yeah I mean I had this for a while and I heard like every two months you're supposed to switch up your mascara but I I don't and it still have like a lot of product left on it well inside a tube and I had this for a while so the Maybelline rocket volume mascara is a really good drugstore mascara also and I only pay a dollar seventy nine for this is the NYC big curl um mascara I love the wand I love big wands like this because I feel like it really value add length to your um lashes and another one is my favorite is the great lashes by Maybelline this is the waterproof one I have another one but I don't really like the wand on that one but I love the one on this one because it's really small and it really get your bottom lashes and your top lashes so these are my most used mascaras I have like these are my go-to mascaras I use so these yeah and another um thing I use a lot and I stopped using it I don't know why but I think I forgot I have it is Nivea, Nivea cream you can purchase this at Target Walmart um yeah so I use this as a lotion before I put my because I have really dry skin so I use this before I put on my primer just to take the dryness out of my face because I have really dry skin so that is a really good product and I use a lot the next most used product is my black radiance um pressed powder and I use it as a contour right here and this is mahogany mahogany rich is the color i use as a contour and like the one thing i like about this no matter your skin complexion it shows up on your face like i have someone right now yeah i love this contour i mean i love this pressed powder and this is my most used powder like this and this like these threes are, and I'm doing them together, my most used powder. But this is a um, high definition, and I use this to set my under eye concealer. And I started using another one, but I just started back using that one, so it's not a most used product. But every time I wear makeup and I wear concealer and I want to set it, this is what I use. And this too, I use that every day when I wear makeup. And this is what I use to set my foundation, my Maybelline. It's so mainly in New York, and my color is Mocha Mocha 360. So this is my most used face powder. Like, it's, you can already see it's getting down there, so I need to get another one of these. And it has a mirror. Like, oop. I don't want to blind you guys. But yeah, this is my most used powder. My two favorite foundation, my, my most used foundation, I'm not making this a favorite video. My most used foundation is the Nearly Naked, the Arabian Line Nearly Naked. Some most used foundation are the Arabian Line Color Stay 24 Hour. My most used foundation, like this is my go-to foundation because it's it's not really a full coverage for me because I have a lot of black areas. I think it's like a medium coverage because once I put this on you still can tell on your eye but it is my most used these two are my most used foundation and there are some really good um drugstore foundation oh um, well, we got three more things and this was to go I forgot another one my LA girl pro concealer but this is of a different color and it doesn't have the color on this one I don't know why my um most Oh my god. This is the only pencil I use for my brows. And this is the color I have is I think it's milk brown, mink brown. And it's a wet and wow brown pencil. It's a, like a brownish black pencil. And I have I did my brows now, so it's this color. This is my most used pencil. Like I tried a lot of different pencils. And this is my favorite pencil out of them all. 
drugstore. The last thing is most used when I do a wing line. I use the Pure Mineral um, eyeliner and I purchased this. You can purchase this from Sephora. So yeah, it's called Pure Mineral. And this is just the regular black gel eyeliner. Uh-oh. So yeah, that, these are my most used products. Um, yeah, so basically when I wear makeup, because I don't wear makeup every day, these are all of my go-to products I use. So and they're almost gone. Like Most of the stuff here is almost gone. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have a question about any products you saw, um, I'm wearing on my lips is lip tar. I don't know what color this is Because I have a sample of this. So I don't know what color it's called, but just go look for the orange Lip tar at Sephora. I purchased this lips not purchase it. I got a sample of the lip tar from Sephora. That's what I'm wearing on my lips, but That is my most used products I use like I tell you guys I don't want makeup every day but when I do these are my products I use all the time when I wear makeup so I hope you guys enjoyed this video I will see you guys in my next update and please suggest videos um videos you guys want to see because not no one have only really been suggesting any videos you guys want to see um anything you guys want to see I will be happy to do a video on it um so comment, like, and subscribe. And please suggest videos you want to Q&A. Um, anything you guys want to see. It doesn't matter. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys in my next update. And have a blessed day. Bye guys.